prison numbers. How does the government come up with prison numbers and what do they mean? DC, like every other city and state, has two courts. One for state and one for federal. If you're arrested for state charges, you're taken to superior court and given a state number. In DC, that number consists of six numbers. And if you are arrested for federal charges, you are taken to the district court and given a federal number. That number consists of eight numbers. My DC number is 235116, meaning I am the 235,116th person arrested in Washington DC since 1875. I was given that number in 1988. Every time I'm arrested, this same number will be used. It will stick with me for the rest of my life. So, in 113 years, DC authorities had over 235,000 new arrests. With repeat arrests, that number goes up to almost 700,000. That was more than the whole population of DC. Now my federal number is 03219000. Let's break that down. All prisoners in the federal system are identified by their prison numbers. The first five numbers indicated how many people were arrested in that jurisdiction since it began. And the last three numbers identify what court they were processed in and what state they were arrested in. The system of numbers was a well-defined and assigned system created by mathematicians that allowed for each district to have up to one million arrests. Some states had more than one district which required a different number for each district. The first system was the Northern District of Alabama with an assigned number of 001. Then it was the Middle District of Alabama at 002. Southern District of Alabama was 003. Then it went to the Southern District of Florida at 004. The Mariana Islands was 005. Alaska was 006 and one of Washington DC's numbers was 007. The numbers went all the way to 098, which was the Southern District of California. So let's use this number as an example. If your federal prison number began with 34256, it meant you were the 34,256 federal prisoner convicted in that district. And the last three numbers identified the actual district you were convicted in. So a prisoner number of 34256001 meant they were the 34,256 federal prisoner convicted in the Northern District of Alabama. If your last three numbers were 098, it meant you were the 34,256 federal prisoner convicted in the Southern District of California. Prisoners from Maryland, federal prison numbers ended in 037, and prisoners from Virginia, federal prison numbers ended in 083 and 084. Montana was 046. Arizona was 008. This system was specifically created and designed to allow up to 1 million prisoners to come through each of the 98 jurisdictions. So it was designed to have at least 98 million prisoners, which is almost 35% of the American population. When the first five numbers hit 99999, the last three numbers would change. 001 would change to 101. 002 would change to 102 and the numbers would start all over again. 00001 slash 101, 00002 dash 101, until it reaches 99999 again. People from DC had three different federal numbers because of the complexities of being a federal city that didn't reside inside of a state. The last three prison numbers for DC ended with 007, 016, or 000. 016 if you are convicted in federal court, which is called district court in DC. 007 if you are convicted in the state slash city court, which is called superior court 
in DC. 000 if you were sent to the feds in the 80s from Lorton because of overcrowding. Your prison number stays with you forever, so my number was 03219000, which meant I was the 3000th, 219th Lorton prisoner transferred to the feds because of overcrowding. I got that number in 1989 after being sent to the feds because of overcrowding. Another DC prisoner may have 03219007, which meant they were the 3000th, 219th prisoner transferred to the federal system from the state system. Another DC prisoner may have 03219016, which meant they were the 3000th, 219th prisoner convicted in DC's federal court. 016 was DC's district. Our state prison Lawton was closed, so everyone convicted in DC is now sent to the federal system. If we would have stayed in Lawton, we would have only needed our DC numbers. The Fed numbers were really only for federal prisoners. 